FTCC Summer Scapes support students 8 to 18 by providing programs that empower them to excel in the arts. Our staff and resources help to build higher self-esteem and self-worth through a variety of learning opportunities to inspire, motivate, and encourage success. I'm Sherry Young. I teach visual arts classes. I have taught elementary art for six years, middle school for two, and many other group paint parties and classes. I'm excited about the opportunity to teach your child in visual arts for the FTCC Summer Skates. For starters, I teach a foundation in the history of each different medium and hands-on basic techniques and strategies to accomplish each work of art. A positive creative atmosphere encourages our students to broaden their interests and skills. Origami. Origami is the delicate art of Japanese paper folding. It began after paper was invented by the Chinese nearly 2,000 years ago. Monks brought paper to Japan and throughout the years the paper choice expanded and the craft developed into a fine art. Learn how to make easy origami with these simple basic folds and base designs used in many projects. We create monsters and peacocks, flowers and frogs, boats, cranes and planes. In addition, we create an eight-page book from one sheet of folded paper. A rocket that can fly. <laughs> and the mouse that can climb. There are lots of projects that are easy and fun to make. Mosaics. Mosaic is the art of creating pictures and patterns composed of small pieces of glass, stone, and other nature-based materials we call tessera. They are arranged into patterns, pictures, and other decorative designs that are held together by an adhesive and grout. Mosaics have been a popular art form in several cultures around the world. The earliest known mosaics were found in a Mesopotamian temple dating back to the 3rd millennium BC. In our four-day session, I teach more about mosaic history and we create our own masterpieces with paper, beans, tiles, and beads. We even color our own beans for a vibrant finale work of art. With just a handful of materials and a couple of tools, we explore your creativity, finding new ways to express yourself. Acrylic painting. Acrylic paint can be traced back to the early 1930s when it was developed by a German chemical company, first used for industrial purposes and then also for the fine arts. Acrylics dry rapidly, giving both the transparent brilliance of watercolor and the density of oil paint. In our art class, you learn the basics of acrylic painting using the elements of art, including color and value, and the principles of design using focal point and composition. We mix and apply values of color to create the illusion of light and form. We explore different techniques for paint applications, such as washing, stippling, layering, splattering, and so many more. One of the more often used techniques is the ombre effect, in which the use of a single color slowly melts into another, creating the gradual blending of one color hue to another, usually moving tints and shades from light to dark. It can be easily used as a background for your own little masterpiece. Come join me in learning how to paint in this style. Creative clay. Clay is used for many purposes way back to the prehistoric times. Functional pottery is thought to have developed around 9,000 BC. In this course, we experiment with creative thinking and apply that to our pottery. I will give you both technical and visual guide and lead you through some really fun projects. We start making pottery with basic pinch pots and then you learn a number of ways to transform those into cups, bowls, and a variety of sculptures, just like this one here started out as a little ball of clay. Then we move into other ceramic methods like coil, slab, and glazing. Our last project celebrates that everyone is different, so all of us should be able to develop work that is unique, 
and authentic. Young Picasso. Painting like the masters is easy and fun. Master artists have a unique feature in their artwork that distinguishes them from other pieces. They use varying techniques such as brush strokes, geometrical shapes, abstract objects, or silhouettes to do all their artwork pieces. It becomes their style. The fact that they were the first to do it in, is which gave them the recognition as a master. We examined several, Picasso, Van Gogh, Modigliani, Matisse, and Monet. I cover historical information about each one and a short overview of their style of work and teach you how to do a painting step by step in their style. Art has the power to transform, educate, inspire, and motivate. From your morning coffee cup to your new outfit, from your house to your office building, an artist was involved in the idea, concept, construction, and finishings. The chances are pretty good your child is going to be involved in a creative field and the skills they learn in art class adds to their success. Each Summerscape art class is a creative expedition filled with curiosity and fascination leading to confidence in their abilities. The classes are every summer from June to August and you're invited to discover and explore the creative possibilities through the FTCC Summerscapes Art Classes with me. For, for any questions, please contact us at 910-678-8309. And remember to register for my classes. I am so excited to get it started.